what's going on guys it's your girl easy breezy and i'm back with another hair sponsor now i feel like even y'all should know this name okay because i've worked with this company many times and i feel like they're a genuine like reputable hair company so today they sent me a really pretty brown highlighted wig and i've received this style wig before but in a four by four closure so this is the first time i've used this wig in a frontal and i'm excited Excited because I know it's gonna give it a different feel than the lace closure wigs all right so let's talk about the model okay so we have my girl flossy in the building and she is new to my channel but she's not new to me at all because when i was doing hair she was definitely one of my clients for years and years and i don't know why this is her first time on my channel because i don't i don't know i've done so many cute spunky hairstyles on her and i guess we really just didn't cross paths until now all right, so I do have a surprise for y'all. Okay, so one of the new products that I've been working on is a hair growth oil. So it's 100% natural, nothing but natural oils and essential oils. And I've been using it on my own head since I started locking. And I will say that my hair is growing fast, it's growing healthy. And I don't know why I didn't choose to bottle this stuff until now. But y'all will be seeing it on my channel a lot now because I'm gonna be using it on all my models because y'all know I test my products out before I sell it just to make sure it works and get reviews, like genuine reviews from people. So I'm excited. All right, cool. So I took my liquid lace glue and applied it a little bit in front of her hairline, waited for it to turn clear, and I applied my stocking cap and gave it a good press. Now I'm taking my scissors and cutting all the extra cap off, and it looks pretty damn good, okay? Can't even see where the thing begin. <laughs> so this is the beige stocking cap from galaxygirlhair.com. All right, so now I'm taking my bottle of liquid lace glue and applying it right in front of the cap. I'm gonna spread it out with my tweezers and wait for it to turn clear. Now, don't mistake this with waiting for it to dry because if it gets too dry and when you touch it with your finger, if it's not like still tacky, then when you stick the lace on there, it's not gonna have no stick power, okay? So don't wait for it to turn dry, just wait for it to turn clear so it can still be sticky. So I'm excited, I'm excited because number one, this hairline looks great, <laughs> okay? And when I showed Floss the, the wig, she loved it. She was like, yes, I've been wanting to do that color. So I'm like, okay, perfect, like perfect. So one thing I was a little bit nervous about was the color of the lace. Like when I was looking at it before she got here, I was like, damn, is it too brown? I was like, damn, I really don't wanna, you know, switch wigs and I wanted to do this look on her. But now that I'm seeing it on her, it does look better than what I thought, but it can be a little more light. Like y'all know when I be complaining about the lace being too light, this is one of those times where I wish it was lighter. <laughs> But it still looks good, you know what I'm saying? It still looks good to me. And especially after we do the style and the baby hair, you know, we're not gonna have nothing to worry about. So I'm loving these highlights. Like, they're so cute and they look so good on her. So even though like some big, body curls will look really cute with this. Uh, we decided to go with a sleek, you know, side part, well, swoop side part. And instead of doing this with got to be glue like I normally do, I'm gonna do it all with tropical root setting foam. 
And the reason being is because even though the Got To Be Glue does work every single time, I feel like the Tropical Root Setting Foam is strong enough to actually hold the style. And I wanna use something just lighter this time, you know, just to try it. All right, so now that we're at the baby hairs, I actually am gonna use Got To Be Glued to hold these down. Okay, so we definitely um, hid the line of the lace with the baby hairs. Now, this won't be able to happen all the time just because it, it doesn't happen to me all the time, but sometimes, you know, you can actually get the baby hairs to make the lace blend in with your model or client's skin without making it look too heavy or look like you're trying to quote unquote cover something up. So now with the foam, if you guys are trying this at home, now I haven't used any lighter setting foams to do stuff like this, like Nairobi or olive oil or something like that, cause I just don't feel like it'll really hold the hair down. The reason why I'm using Tropical Roots specifically is because this setting foam is really sticky. And it's so sticky that you can use it for baby hair and like nothing else. So yeah, instead of using gel, you know, globbing all that stuff on her hair, I thought that Tropical Roots will, it'll work, it'll work. And it is working. But see, the only downfall is that she's gonna have to sit under the dryer for a cool, 30 to 40 minutes just so all that liquid under there can fully dry from the inside. All right, cool. So the swoop is looking flat, looking good. And now I'm going to stick on these rhinestones to give it some little bling bling. And sometimes I use the lace glue to attach these, but lately I've just been using the little sticky pad behind them so they're not permanent and you can like flick them off <laughs> when you wanna, you know, look normal.
Okay, so these curls are looking really, really cute. You know what I'm saying? But of course, we have to take our wide tooth comb and give it some some motion in the ocean, make it look softer. So I'm gonna take my comb and my hairspray and start sculpting, baby. Listen, I don't know about y'all, but this came out cute. <laughs> like, this came out really, really cute. So, once again, thank you so much, Nadula, for sponsoring this video with this brown, pretty highlighted wig. If you guys want this exact unit, I'm going to put all the information in the description below. If you're not subscribed to my channel already, listen, what, what, what are you doing? Make sure you go ahead and do that and turn on your notifications. See y'all later.